okay so now let's create a new file inside of the screens called user state dot dot and in here we will manage if the user is logged in or not and depending on that we will show different screens so it is actually a stateless widget I will name it as user state we need to import the material package and in here we need to initialize a stream builder so for the builder we need to provide the context and call in here the snapshot like this and open to parentheses just like this now we need to provide stream for the stream for sure and we need to provide the firebase auth dot instance dot auth state change so this is notify us about the user actions such as login register or sign out so in here let's say if user snapshot dot connection state equal equal connection state dot waiting we will show a center and give it a circular progress indicator else if the connection state is active we will show something different and in here add if like this now inside of it if snapshot let's say if snapshot has data so if the user is logged in we need to show a different screen which is the page view screen so actually the main screen and if it doesn't we need to show the landing page like this and finally let's say if so in here let's say if it has error so let's say user snapshot dot has error and let's return center and as a child show a text saying error occurred just like this and here we need to return it and now this is will be our main screen so let's go back to the main in here and as the home call the user state and import it let's restart our application now and try to log in or create a new account okay so now let's try to log in like this and nothing is changed so once the user log in and once it is successfully done we need to pop up the screen so let's go to the login screen in here and let's say in here then if it can pop so call can pop like this then pop it just like this pop call pop just like this let's save it now try to log in again okay so now this page is being displayed it's because we just changed it a few tutorials ago in here I'm calling the landing page not this page if I save it now 
so this page is being displayed even if I restarted now this page would be displayed so now we are saving the state of the user and to prove it I will go to the user state screen so in here actually we can get rid of those annoying lines just press on this icon in here and ignore this missing return because we don't actually missing any return we are returning it depending on the F statements so in here if this is the case let's print the user is already logged in and and the else let's say the user didn't log in yet just like this let's save it so here it is it's being called so whenever our app is being launched or restarted this page will be initialized and depending on the user state we will show different screens in the next video we will implement the logout so stay tuned